You're listening to Dean Michael here on True Radio, the home of proper good music. And tonight, my special guest is Rosala. Hi, Rosala, you're still there. Hi, Dean. I'm still here. I'm still here. Enjoying the music. Enjoy the music. It's sounding <laughs> good. It's always so surreal to hear my songs being played on radio. I think, is that really me? Oh, it's so lovely. I know. So don't you sound di- do, you, do you find that you sound different to what you, you hear in yourself when you're recording the songs? That when you hear them on the radio, yeah. it sort of sounds a little bit different. I think, I, I think the feeling, Dean, is it's just so. Put it this way: it will never get lost on me to hear my songs being played on the radio when I'm I eat in a, in a shopping mall or I turn on the radio and I'm driving my car. I tell you that the, my heart starts <laughs> racing with excitement, I know. and I want to call people and tell them, "Who's on. on the radio?" And I'm actually thinking it's me. <laughs> <laughs> Fabulous, absolutely. It's just wonderful, wonderful. Oh, it is. Now, you must be so proud of yourself as well because you toured with a big, mega, 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 mega star uh, back a few years ago now, but so when he was alive, Mr. Michael Jackson. You did the Dangerous yeah. Tour. How was that? Yeah, that was, honestly, I will go, I will always say, Dean, you know, that was one of the highlights of my career to have supported at the time, the biggest star on planet Earth. You know, let's face it, he was was incredible. And, you know, every night when I was able to, if I weren't either jumping straight on the tour bus to go to the next venue or go to the airport, I mean, it it was back-to-back busy. We stayed behind and we were allowed to go to places where, um, you know, the the normal public weren't uh, able to go because we had the triple A passes, you know, so... (laughs) Access all areas. new to us and we were so excited and sometimes I used to stand uh you know there was the stage and then there was an in-between where security guards were and then there was a barrier and then of course there was the audience and sometimes I would still stand in between on the side of the stage and, and watch Michael and just go oh my gosh until Michael sent word to his security guard saying please tell Rosella not to stand in the corner because she's you know confusing me she's uh you know making me lose my concentration <laughs> Did you ever get to meet him and talk to him personally or was, was that not allowed? No, I got to meet him twice. Uh, when I first uh, joined the tour, he in fact asked to meet me personally. So we took official pictures with him and I and he was really so down to earth and so welcoming. And he personally chose me on the tour because at the time I had three major hits across Europe, which was Everybody's Free to Feel Good. Faith in the Power of Love and Are You Ready to Fly? And I just signed to Sony and he was signed to Sony. So some of the good people at Sony pushed me forward to Michael and go, you know, listen to her. And he personally chose me, which, you know, I'll be eternally grateful to you. So we took pictures and, um, and then I met him again towards the end of the tour. I believe it was in Portugal, uh, just to say bye. And he gave me a kiss on my lips to say uh-huh. thank you. Uh, and then uh, you know he was really nice. He was really nice. Yeah, I, I believe he's. I've I've heard he's so sweet and everything, and with people. Yeah, I never actually was. met him, but um, I would have loved to have met him. You know, but uh, oh, he well, was. you're very, very lucky, and you, you're very, I, very totally, honest. Totally, <laughs> and and Dean, I have to say to to watch him perform on stage on the, the, his last tour, which was the Dangerous Tour, the one I was on was like magic unfolding every night. It was so superb and so so surreal. Yeah. I it was it. just it was truly just magnificent. I bet it was. I bet it was. Okay now Rosala, you've got a brand new single coming out. Uh, well it's out this week actually. And we're going to be talking about that after these next few records. So for now, Rosala, thank you for being with us. Thank you.